Hey guys, uh, welcome back to another video. Welcome back to Tapshree Tech and Reviews. So today it's another unboxing video. I'll be unboxing this package which I ordered from Amazon. So it's a smartwatch from Firebolt. So recently I had visited uh, Reliance Digital. Uh, there I came across a lot of Firebolt watches and you know I was really impressed uh, from the first look. Uh, the quality of watch was really good so that's when i thought of buying uh, five bolt watches so i ordered one from amazon it's called uh, five bolt visionary so let's get in the video unbox this see what's inside the package how's the quality and uh, for information it's a renewed product uh, which i ordered from amazon uh, so yeah let's check out how the renewed product quality is so yeah let's get in the video please enjoy so this is how the product has arrived no, completely neatly packed though it's a renewed product they have packed it nicely so let's unbox this so before unboxing this uh, let's see what's the price I've paid so this is what I ordered I paid around uh, 2900 something so this is a product you see it's called Firebolt Visionary it's 1.78 inches uh, it has AMOLED screen as well and uh, one more good thing is it has TWS connection you can connect it to your speaker that's what I believe so I bought this color and apart from that uh, regular features like heart rate monitoring SPO2 voice assistance these are the other features that it has and bluetooth calling smartwatch as well so bluetooth calling is also available in this let's unbox and see if uh, the watch looks the same or not so yeah as i told it's a renewed product it could save about 500 600 rupees that's all so as soon as you open this you get this one there's a bill copy So as soon as you open, I don't know why they have given such a big box inside this is a very small product. So this is the actual product. So nothing else. You see it says visionary. Of course the box looks um, kind of used as it's a renewed product. So old box, 45mm, it says AMOLED touch display or treat 110 plus ports modes spo2 always on display also it has it says so ip68 what resistant it is connect aws is there amulet display is also there and let's see the price they have put is 17,999 the current price is about 3800 something for a new one so let's see so let's remove the sticker so let's remove the sticker so as soon as you remove the sticker here's the watch this is how it looks Oh, this okay somehow took it out so this is the watch guys not sure if it's visible uh, I don't see any scratches so that's one good thing so there are two buttons one is a roller and there is a actual button here and it looks as I told previously when I went to Reliance Digital I was really impressed by its looks the quality was really good the same thing which I'm feeling today as well, the quality looks really good. Here if you see, there is a little bit of wear and tear. But that is expected. And uh, let's try to turn this on. Looks like they have not even charged this. Not able to turn it on in the first try. Maybe I'll have to put it for charging. So there is only worry, there is a little wear and tear. Not sure if it is actual manufacturing defect or uh, I 
happened because of a lot of use. That let's see what what else is in this box. So there are some user manuals which they have provided. Model number is BSW0W6. I hope it's the same watch. So a lot of things to read there. And the usual cards, you know, which they provide. So that's some odd four cards they have given here. So there's a free movie ticket they are saying. And there is this charger as well. It's not a round or you know charging dial. You'll have to put something like this and charge it. But it's magnetic, so it's good. So let me put this for charging and come back. So when it's charging, it looks something like this. Let's try to turn this on now. So it's charged now and uh, I've charged it a little and this is how it looks and also played around a little and I've turned on uh, the always on display so this is how the time is going to show when always on is turned on but there's a delay once you press any button there's a delay to you know show up the next screen So then you'll see all the usual menus, sleep, measure HR, heart rate, BP, SpO2. So apart from that, so by mistake if you click anything, it is going to take time to stop that there is that delay as well and for this phone call you need to pair the phone and this always on is a little too fast I'm not sure if you can configure that then there is AI voice then there is weather and the usual uh, you know you can add any other components if you want and if you press this dial uh, roller So before that let me just turn off uh, the always on because that's creating issue you can just click close and uh, if you press uh, if you click on this uh, dial once a roller dial on the side it's going to bring up this menu wherein it will show you all the you know uh, options that's available all the menus that's available you can uh, roll this to zoom in or zoom out to bring in that you know apple watch effect so something like this and it's smooth as well not very smooth but smooth enough this is how it looks hopefully if you can add additional components uh, it would uh, you know add up a lot over here and you can uh, make use of this feature as well but if it's not going to add any components i don't think so this is of much use hopefully we can add some new components let's see and if you swipe from the top you'll see all the immediate menus bluetooth if you want to on the vibration mode then there is torch mode so little the brightness will be increased and you can increase the brightness here as well and there is a theater mode which will uh, turn off the bi uh, vibration and turn down the brightness and it will display the uh, weather here once it is once your phone is paired so apart from that So apart from that, what we'll do is um, we'll try to connect 
to this has a audio and here how the sound comes out of this so there are two options to connect either connect uh, the fireboard has a watch or connect this has a audio device so we'll connect it as a audio device now so if you see here there is uh, audio firebolt 046 and there is just firebolt 046 this will connect as watch itself this will connect as a audio device so let me try connecting it's connected so i've connected uh, connected it to my uh, you know the smart watch as a audio device let me play this song and see how the sound comes out So the sound is coming out of this. It's pretty loud, not very loud, loud enough. You know, there's a little speaker here from where the sound is coming out. So let me play that again. So let me take this closer to the mic and show you. So that how that's how loud it is. So they have told about TWS also. I'm not sure if this is the true wireless speaker which they are talking about because I don't see any other options in the settings, you know, to connect uh, to our speakers or earphones or earbuds. What we have in the settings, if you see uh, the other, uh, you know. Um, generic options vibration then display low power mode theater mode phone call call reset ai voice system so so the watch is really premium and um, it really does the job well um, only issue is uh, this if you're buying a renewed product there will be some issues so this is one issue and the other issue here what I found is um, if I connect it to a Bluetooth sometimes it connects sometimes it doesn't connect so now it is connected so it shows uh, Bluetooth you know in blue color once it is connected and uh, the reaction time is very slow so once it is connected as well i didn't see the this changing phone call is still the same it keeps saying uh, please try pairing because it's already paired now if you see other devices firebolt it's paired but maybe i'm missing out something here and because of that not able to try uh, this phone call and ai yeah, voice so let me try to fix this and see if I can fix it. If I cannot, then I'll have to raise it with Amazon and see what they, you know, uh, say about it. So you can uh, select between different watch faces as well. They have some, uh, you know, inbuilt inbuilt dials were available. Not great, but. Uh, okay but i doubt you can install your own maybe th there is some hack but uh, i'm not aware of um, so there are some predefined dials which you can use this one looks like inspired by apple watch and there are other as well So this is how it looks once you wear it. So color is a mismatch but it's fine. You can change the strap if you want. On this side it is golden color. The strap is uh, light gold. So this is how it looks. So yeah that's about it guys. Uh, it was a quick review about this watch. Hope you liked it. Uh, let me know your views on this. Hope you all like the video guys. If you like the video, please do the like button, subscribe, comment. Let's catch again next video. Until then, see you. Bye.